Ashton taking on Austin. New Zealand actor Penny Ashton has been performing the works based on Jane Austen for the better part of a decade and has taken this one-woman show around the world. She last performed it in Dunedin at the 2014 Festival of the Arts. And she's even been audacious enough to take it to the home of the 18th century writer in England. You know, she's actually buried in Winchester, so I went there. I went to Bath, to the houses. She lived in a house in Gay Street and in Trim Street and various other places in Bath. Um, and it was just amazing to just sort of be there and walk around where she walked and, and go to the Jane Austen Centre and things. It was fabulous. Ashton says some recent movies draw heavily from Jane Austen, as many of the themes she explored are current today. She just has wonderful dialogue, particularly. Um, really funny, really quite sarcastic and cutting, um, which I think a lot of people don't sort of realise, but she is quite fabulous. Uh, also, Jane Austen's stories are very universal uh, even today, which is why things like Bridget Jones' Diary works, Clueless, which is based on Emma, etc., um, that they are all about the universal search for love and security. During the show, Ashton takes on nine characters, swapping between them with almost too much ease. So they may be tolerable to look at, but I expect they will not be handsome enough to tempt me onto the dance floor, where I've got the mother who's like, happiness in marriage is entirely a matter of chance. And then there's the lead character who's sort of much more like me. And then her sister, who's very silly and just sort of throws herself about. And then there's also the, the very jovial trap and the very, you know, sort of Lady Catherine de Bourgh character who talks like the Queen, basically. I'm just mainlining the Queen. Uh, yes, so that, that's how I do it, basically. <laughs> The fluidity with which she swaps characters comes with experience as she's performed the work more than 200 times. The first show in the Otago season tomorrow is a fundraiser for Rape Crisis Dunedin. Darrell Beza, The South Today.